One guy, I'm by God's sport, <laughs> my favorite athlete. I'm by no sport, but uh, I don't know, I don't know. You think? Yeah. You're I mean, big? if you look oh. good, I'm a fan of you, so. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Bonjour, bonsoir, l'Union Suite. I'm Steven Baboon, and today I'm going to be sharing some of my faves. Harmony, Match.com, yeah. my favorite alcoholic drink. Um, wait, that's my favorite word. Um, wait is my favorite word and forever will be my favorite word. Wow, class préféré me l'école. <laughs> Dang. Actually, my favorite class in school was biology and art. Parce que, yeah. Manger préféré me c'est, okay, really, really specific. Duri John John et Equivis non sauce créole, Pickles, souffle mai, and a little bit of zaboka. But the zaboka has to be just ripe enough, not too mushy, like a little hard. So that's my favorite, favorite food. Yeah, my favorite alcoholic drink. I told myself I always hated gin, but I think it's an acquired taste. So my favorite alcoholic drink is gin. And that's pretty recent because my second favorite is tequila. So. Wow, I have so many. My favorite celebrity crush at the moment is Odell Beckham Jr. I'm obsessed. And my other celebrity crush would probably be my queen, Lady Gaga, which I love, I love, I love. One guy, I'm by God's sport. I'm my favorite athlete. I'm by no sport, but. I don't know, I don't know. You're I'm, big. Yeah. You're I mean, big. if you look oh. good, I'm a fan of you, so. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> My favorite non Haitian female artist is. Oh, it's a lot. I'm gonna name two. Janelle Monet is my favorite, and then. Uh, that's so hard. And I think. I'm gonna say Lady Gaga, she's my favorite. So Janelle Monáe and Lady Gaga, I've been obsessed since I was a kid. So do you want to play me? Oh, meet them no show on that. Oh my God, my favorite one, one. I can't say multiple. Okay, well, I have a lot of favorites, but it just depends on my vibe. But this month, these couple months, I've been on a Naika vibe. So Naika is at the moment my favorite Haitian uh, female artist. My favorite Kwampa song. At the moment, is Kama Sutra by Impossible, but not the album. The album is great, but the song Kama Sutra, yo, I don't know. It just puts me in a good mood every time I'm feeling low. I just blast it, and I feel like I'm home by the beach, and I feel like I'm recharged. So that's my favorite. My first date. I feel like this is an application for like eHarmony, Match.com. <laughs> so si n'interesse, nous check it. Um, Favorite place for a date? Honestly, I'm a very simple person. For me, the, the person is the date. The person is the quality. But I love anything by the water. I love food. So a perfect date, honestly, a good ass restaurant. And then a stroll by the water. And then whatever happens next, happens next. So that's my favorite, kind of my favorite vibe. My favorite go-to apology gifts. I love giving people photography. I love giving people images. So just a photo I'm printing, I frame it myself, I write a little note, that's my, that's my, that's my apology gift. Yes, you know, I'm a little soft boy. <laughs> my favorite place to visit in the world, beside my homelands of Haiti and Syria, would have to be Tokyo. I went to Tokyo in 2019 and honestly, I thought I was in the future. It's such an amazing city, so Tokyo would be my, Tokyo is my favorite place so far. <laughs> my favorite thing to do when I'm alone, I love to write, but when I'm not writing, I binge watch uh, like crime documentaries. I love crime documentaries for some reason, so that's my favorite thing. Favorite TV show growing up would have to be Pokemon, and I don't know if the OGs remember this, Digimon. Y'all remember Digimon? No, 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 nobody remembers. Digimon was my favorite, and then, yeah, Pokemon and Digimon. And I want to say Naruto. Naruto is my favorite too. So. So many things, but my favorite thing about my job is that I connect with the community. You know, um, whether it's through my art and my comedy, I'm telling you that I'm going to send a message to the people who 
you know, like, thank you for your work, ou bien, wow, comme si photographe ça fait me sentir un bagage, ou bien vidéo fait à just fait journée mon petit jambe bon. So, I love to make people feel good, and so that's my favorite part of my job. L'aime stressé, bagage préféré pour me faire, c'est I take my dose of CBD, um, I listen to music, et puis me conduit. Moi, me conduit, l'aime conduit. Et par contre, je pour comme, quand je réfléchis, so, c'est ça me fait, je me stresse. Ah, oh, damn. Ok, je suis seulement 24. So, je suis la jeunesse 24 ans. L'âge préféré, je veux dire, honnêtement, 21 ans. 21 ans, c'était un bon âge. Je um, suis travaillé beaucoup et j'ai rencontré des amis vraiment, vraiment, lifelong friends. So, 21 ans, c'était un mess, mais c'était génial. My favorite place to visit in Haiti, I know some people are going to think I'm going to say Jacques Mel, Ocap, etc. But my grandma's house in Port-au-Prince is my favorite place to go because I grew up in the basement of my grandma and it kind of recenters me. So I love to go to her house. She cooks my favorite food. I chill with her. We drink coffee. So that's my favorite place. But second favorite place is Jacques Mel for life. I love, I love Jacques Mel. Mon cher, en vente plutôt texte mais qu'on a plutôt appel téléphone. You know, now, like, I don't know, like, I, now I love to hear people's voices and I love to have, like, deep, meaningful conversation, especially avec tout bail qui a dans le monde, to really hear somebody's voice and to show them how much you love them vocally. Un petit appel, Kounia. Mais, it depends. But yeah, call. I like calls. Top three songs on my playlist right now is Find Your Way Home, Beyonce. Um, uh, wow, ça a duré, ma préfléchie, ça m'a tenté matin. Overdose, Felicia Ross, and Impossible, and I'm back to An Alley by Michael Bourne and Ram. I love that song, it's a great song. So, top three for now, yeah. I love the morning. I love the morning because I love to take my time, fetch cafe, relax, you know, answer some emails, pray, and just start my day. But the mornings are my favorite, it's my, it's my most peaceful time, so yeah. Umwe, that's my favorite word. Umwe is my favorite word and forever will be my favorite word. So, that's my fave. Oh my God. Wanda, girl, these questions are really good. Top three, number one is Rihanna, for sure. I've always loved her. Ever since I saw a little Caribbean woman making it into pop music, I knew like everything was possible for us Caribbean folks. So Rihanna, for sure. Um, I would love to photograph Solange Knowles. I think she's such a strong visual artist and I would love to see how I photograph her. And last person, Sadzui. I have to pick my, I have to, I have to pick great. Who's somebody I'm, I'm in love with right now? And I think Ariana Grande, honestly, I would love to shoot. So that's my top. Weather préféré, c'est bon petit soleil, moi. Sun, blue skies, no clouds. That's my favorite weather. Top five things I'm going to live without you is my phone, camera, music, gal galleries, wherever art is shown, um, movies, and then... You know, I'm going to switch it up. I'm going to say my family, my support system. My favorite rule in life, and that's what my dad has always instilled in me when I, when I was growing up, is to always be kind and compassionate to people. You know, people think this, it's naive, but kindness goes a long way. And so I always, everything I do, I do it with kindness and I do it with, with love. So that's my top lesson. The top three favorite things I learned during the pandemic is one, to tell people how much you love them. I know it sounds sappy and, and, and everything, but life is so uncertain. And I don't know, the pandemic just showed me that you really have to just tell people how much you love them. It doesn't matter how close they are to you, how far. Um, friendship wise two is as human beings we are so limitless i mean during quarantine i had a lot of time to reflect on myself and quarantine is the reason my marie claude character exists i was in a very dark depressed place and then she came and saved me with her comedy so you're human and you can do whatever you set your 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 heart to and your your dreams to and number three is to slow down um, we're so used to go, 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 especially me living in New York. It's always let's go, let's go, let's go. But the pandemic really taught me to slow down and I'm so appreciative of that. So top three things I learned.